Hey guys, welcome back, or not, well, yeah, welcome back to the channel. But today we're here with our first episode of Far Cry 4. Uh, fun fact, this is one of the only Far Cry games I never finished. Uh, I never finished this, and I never finished New Dawn and Far Cry 1. I finished Far Cry 2, 3, uh, Blood Dragon, and 5. But I never finished this or New Dawn. So once we get to New Dawn, that'll be a first for me to actually play more than two hours of. So, but yeah, we're here. We're going to start on normal. Start offline. Save game already exists. Do you want to overwrite it? Yes, I do. So I was trying to do the battles at uh, Kyrat. Kyrat? 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 I don't know how the fuck you would say it. But I was trying to do those because there's a trophy where I have to play every single game mode um for a trophy and that's part of the platinum but the servers are dead there's no one playing the servers so it's it's tough i've tried doing reddit posts and stuff like that too but it's not working out sadly but yeah this is one of the games i never finished um i, I barely even played it since i bought the ps4 version uh, since I bought the PS4 version, I think I bought it last year. Uh, I've played two hours of it, as you guys saw in the main menu. Um, and I haven't played it since. So this is basically a new experience for me on the PS4 version. I've only ever played the 360 version for an excessive amount of time. Karat. We can That's only accept your status it. as a U.S. citizen as we have no official records regarding your karate citizenship. Furthermore, I must legally advise you against traveling into Karat. We have no official diplomatic presence in Karat due to the civil unrest with the Golden Path. This game looks really good. For being 2014. You'll need to bring with you the passport for the deceased. The original and the Passport. What's happening? Patna boss. Patna. Patna me ja. Parva hai? Do. Baad me ja. Lekin hamari range me. Hey. Maine kaha. Baad me ja. Kuch hai? Abhi tak kuch nahi. Koi baat nahi, boss. Koi baat nahi. Ye lo. Stop. Mil gaya? Kuch mil gaya? Aao. Chalo, chalo. Bahar se niklo. Hey, ruk. Ruko. Saale. I distinctly remember saying, stop the bus. Yes, stop the bus, not shoot the bus. I'm very particular with my words. Stop, shoot, stop, shoot. Do those words sound the same? That it got out of control. I'm sorry, I didn't hear you. What'd you say? It got out of control. Got out of control. 
I hate when things get out of control. Oh! You fucking Jeffrey, you couldn't fucking do that! There's a silver lining. We didn't completely fuck it up. Get up, boy. I'd recognize those eyes anywhere. <laughs> I'm so sorry about this. This was supposed to be... Well, not this. We have a party waiting for you. But I don't think I know your name. Who is this? Hmm? Is this your plus one? <laughs> Strong silent type. I like it. I am terribly embarrassed about all of this. This was supposed to be very simple, but you know, if you... You oh. flew to monkeys, they just... blow their shit at each other. You know? Oh, would you hold this? For just a moment, I want to... get a little... Sure, right into the camera. There we are. Awesome. Don't worry about a thing, my boy. This will soon be behind us. And we'll be off on a grand adventure. Because I have cleared my calendar for you. You and I are gonna tear shit up! <laughs> Wonderful should intro. I stay or should I go? This is a little bit of more of a goofier intro compared... Well, it's more of a goofier game compared to Far Cry 3. If you like Far Cry 3, you, you're going to like the Doom play this game has because it's Far Cry 3's gameplay just enhanced. I must say, Paul, your little corner of Kiratu is rather beautiful. I expected more, you know, chains and wailing, but knowing you somewhere around here is a dark place where the secrets flow like the blood <laughs> that wry smile betrays you again diplume <laughs> well go on take the bloody bag off his head again terribly sorry for what happened before this is more what i had in mind so, fresh start. Introductions. RJ Gale, our guest of honor. Paul, our very gracious host. The little monkey, whose name I still don't know. And I, of course, am Pagan Men. You really don't remember me, do you? Your mother, she never spoke of me, never mentioned me. No. We'll change all that. Paul, I need cash. Uh, how much do you need? All of it. Thank you. Here we are. Ah. Hmm. All right. <coughs> with this, with the smile. <clears throat> That's you. That's me. Although I'm not so sure anymore. Now, your mother. Your mother, on hey. the other hand, she understood me. She knew me in a way that no one ever did. Hmm. That takes me back. The last time I saw you, <coughs> years ago, she told me she loved me. Women, they can do that. They can tell you they love you in the moment and mean it. Men, on the other hand, no, men only really love you in hindsight. And too much distance has built up. So, when your mother decided to flee to the United States with you on her hip, I couldn't help but blame myself. Then I realized, it's not me, no. It was the fucking golden path. <laughs> Those fucking terrorists, they ruin everything. Like dinner. Did no one ever teach you that it's rude to text at the table? Let's see here. Give me the phone. Really, guys, we're not checking for these anymore? Ah, I'm with RJ Gale. You'll love this part. Help. <laughs> a text for help. You don't text for help, you cry for help. So come on, you're gonna cry for help. If you're gonna do something, you're gonna do it right. Here we go. Go on. Cry for help. Cry for help. Help? Oh, 
Oh, pathetic. No, cry for help. Help! You mean it, boy. Help! help! From your diaphragm! Help! help! Shh, 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 shh. Now we listen. Nothing. I'm afraid they're not coming for you, buddy. <laughs> oh! Find out what he knows. Terrorists, right? Now, please, stay right here. Enjoy the crab rangoon. Don't move. I will be right back. Yuma, we need to talk. All right. We could sit here if we wanted to and end the game like that and just be done with it. But that's not how I want to play the game. We're going to explore Ping or Paul's Mansion, right? This is Paul's Mansion, I believe. This game really does look better than I thought it would. What the fuck? For being a 2014 game. Read it. Looks very sad. Brass knuckles, ammo for a handgun, and ten thousand dollars. All right, let's keep heading downstairs. Ajigali. My name is Sabal. I'm with the Golden Path. Golden Path? We're friends. I knew your father. We're here to rescue you, son of Mohan. What about Darpan? You are our priority. We need to get you out of here safely, no matter the cost. Darpan would understand. Now stay close. Shit, they know we're here. The door! Quickly! Ajay, with these doors open, I need you to keep your head down and make a run for the truck. Move as fast as you can. Understand? Yeah, yeah, I got it. One, two, three! Stay close! Hey, here we go. Keep your head down! I'm the truck. Go! I cover you! Fuck! The goddamn elephant. You wanna know what I find funny too? I turned off music and it's still playing music. <laughs> I'm turning down the master audio a little bit because it's really loud. What the hell? There's a gun underneath the dashboard! Use it! Ew, what is this sensitivity? Are we safe? <laughs> Probably not. On your right! Shoot! Damn! Fucking hell! Watch out! Oh my god, it handles like poo, dude. Okay. 
Okay. Aim assist is on. Drive and shoot auto aim. Disable loot animations. I'm gonna turn that on. I'm gonna disable loot animations because they get annoying. got wrecked bro <laughs> we just got punted off the side of a mountain like it was nothing if you're hearing this respond Ante Gale respond please hello Thank you. This is about. Where are you? I don't know. Fuck. The driver's dead. <sighs> okay, listen to me. Look around. You should be able to see a tower nearby. I need you to make your way there. I'm on my way to secure it now. Head to the tower. Okay. You can do this, Ajay. Tower's all the way up there. Throw a rock. Okay, crouch. Same fundamentals as Far Cry 3. See you guys later. going towards the tower yeah so I we're gonna pick this game up relatively fast you know what I mean it's same fundamentals as Far Cry 3 uh, I am glad we're playing it though on the channel because I I've never finished this game fully and I mean I would like to see what this game has to offer entirely so And I do like the way a lot of the systems in this game works compared to Far Cry 3's. I think this... I think this game has a lot... All its systems are more... Uh, uh, what do you call it? More polished. I like the way the skill tree works in here. I like the way hunting works, side missions... Uh, and things like that. This it, Overall, this game just has more going for it because it, of course it's because it was uh it came out at a later time than far cry 3 you know what i mean it's um it came out what how many years after after far cry 3 oh i only can have one give me they came back 
I thought I could have a sidearm and a primary right off the bat, but I guess not. Oh, nope. You gotta unlock all the slots. Okay. But yeah, I'm excited to play this game. I'm excited for when we go back and play Far Cry 5, because I played the entirety of Far Cry 5. Uh, I just, like, I'm like 10 trophies away from the Platinum. And we can play through all the... We're going to play through all the DLCs on the channel, too, for Far Cry 5, which I'm super excited for, because I didn't play through any of the DLCs uh, that much, at least. I played a little bit through Vietnam and a little bit through Survivor, through uh, Mars. Be playing through all those on the channel and New Dawn, but those are later down the line for sure. Because, um, I mean, right now we got... Uh, after this game, we're going to Arkham City... And then Horizon Zero Dawn. And then Darksiders 2. And then after Darksiders 2, we're going to go to probably Sleeping Dogs, I want to say. I don't know. It depends on what's PS Plus games for next month and things like that. I don't have it fully mapped out of what we're playing. All I know is at, right after this, we're going to uh, Arkham City. Well, actually, we'll probably go to Horizon Zero Dawn, then Arkham City. And then after Arkham City, we'll do Darksiders 2. I'm not fully sure yet. Uh, for be, Purely because... Let's see if I can open his crate with this. Uh, I don't know for sure yet, because I want to play all of uh, Horizon Zero Dawn as soon as possible. Which is April 19th, so... We'll probably end up playing Horizon Zero Dawn after this game. And then we'll do Arkham City after this, or after that. Man just had a condom chilling on him. Jesus. I let you out of your cage, you douche. <laughs> yeah, I, I'd rather have those uh, animations off. Because searching bodies and taking forever to search them and skinning animals too like it just it's it's a lot of time you actually just sit here watching those animations you know what i mean so i'm glad that that's an option i remember it being an option in far cry 5 i didn't know it was an option in this game can i get up thank you oh that's not what i wanted to do but i think this game's about 12 hours long i don't think it's that long of a game I mean, I mean, what, Far Cry 3 was fairly short too, right? Far Cry 3 was like, maybe 10 hours? To get the Platinum, it was like 20. So I don't think this game is going to be long. You don't mind me calling, do you? Fantastic. You really are an excellent listener. Look, no hard feelings about the Crab Rangoon. I know it's not to everyone's taste. But you'll be pleased to know I had the chef executed for his incompetence. Or was it his family we killed? <laughs> Regardless, next time I can promise you a better spread. That's the last time I'm kidnapping a fucking TV celebrity chef. We're almost there. Huh. Same stuff as Far Cry 3. Far Cry 5 is where it really separates. And, like, Far Cry evolves. You know what I mean? This is a lot of the same stuff from Far Cry 3. But Far Cry 2 was completely different. Far Cry 3 and 4 were really close to be close to each other. And then Far Cry 5 is insanely different. And then New Dawn's just an RPG for some reason. And then Far Cry 6 hopefully will be more like Far Cry 2. 
Cause that's what I'm hoping is uh, Far Cry 6 is more like Far Cry 2. But what I've seen, it's going to be more like New Dawn without the RPG mechanics. It's an honor to meet you, and I, Mohan. well, without I'm like you made it all major the RPG mechanics. Own. I'm just Jamal worried. You, all right, thank you, lady. I'm just worried for Far Cry 6. It comes out later this year, but I'm worried about it. I, I don't think it's going to be a good game. I really don't. Ubisoft has been kind of messing up lately. I didn't enjoy Valhalla either just because Valhalla was really long. I, I mean, I liked Valhalla, but it, it could have been better for sure. And, I mean, I was disappointed with Watch Dogs Legion. It wasn't Archie, that it. good. Good job, son of Mohan. Why are you guys helping me? You're the son of Mohan. And I, I mean, you may not know it, Far Cry New Dawn was just horrible. Especially for the Golden Bath. Are those army guys still looking for me? Pagan men will stop at nothing to get you back. Damn. Some of Pagan's men managed to track us. They'll be here any second. We're in for a fight. I'm gonna go upstairs and shoot them from above. Harpoons? There's a harpoon gun in this game? Dude, I can't, I can't see anyone. They're just like everywhere. God, I'm gonna have to get used to this game's sensitivity. Like the sensitivity is fine when it's like this, but aiming down is so weird. Can I mess with ADS sensitivity at all? No. I can just mess with the sensitivity itself. But six, like... Oh, that's horrible. That's even worse. I need it higher, I think, is my problem. Let's try 12. Avalanche! Take cover! Okay, hold on. That's, that's one too high. Just let's, yeah. hey, we'll, do, we'll do ten. Jesus, I was just trying to get ammo. <laughs> I, all I want. I don't think I've ever opened up this entire map either for this game. Tough man to kill, brother. That's a good thing, right? Prologue complete. That's gonna be our Dennis, I guess is what you could say. That'll be our Dennis for this game. Dennis was the guy who put the first tattoo on us in, uh, Far Cry 3 and then helped us throughout the entire game of Far Cry 3 till he was a crackhead at the end and he killed uh, he killed what's her face on accident um, what was her name Try with a C or something right how did you know to find me you saw Bacon's chopper nearby he's never down this far south and I wanted to know why lucky for you we were in the area when we got Darpan's text. Well, we're here. Welcome to Banapur, home of the Golden Path. Who's this? Where's Darpan? He didn't make it. 
This is Ajay Gale. Mohan's son. Let me understand. Dapan's dead? Hmm? And you brought me this. I'm not involved in, in whatever this is. I'm just looking for Lakshmana. We're in the middle of a fucking war. We don't have time for tourists. What was I supposed to do? Just leave him there? I'm sorry, brother. Amita's a little touchy. I'll talk to her. As for Lakshmana, it sounds like it could be a temple or shrine. But if that's the case, it's in the north. The north is enemy territory, and we can't get you there. Not yet. Go and clear your head. Come find me when you're ready. Hmm? Okay. So this game still has the radio towers, but in, the, in this game it's bell towers. Um, to open up the map. You get free weapons still from it and stuff like that. I, well, I think you do. I don't remember. Um, but yeah, so if we go to the map. This, see, I never went this far north, ever. Uh, Ping Min's Fortress. Yeah, I never went that far north. Um, just because I don't, I, I've never really had a reason to. Because I never finished the game. I never got high enough. Skill tree. Crafting. This we've all seen that before. This is the this is even the exact same. Um we get weapons whenever there's a gun symbol. So we get weapons from outposts, fortresses, and bell towers, but we don't get one until the old very last bell tower. Uh, we don't get a signature weapon until level 6 in Karma. Um, we don't get a weapon until we did 4 armed escorts, 4 hostages. I'll, slow, I'll do some of these too off camera because some of these guns, I'm pretty sure, if I remember correctly, are really good. So, yeah, collection and tactics. Alright, who do we want to talk to first? I guess let's talk to her. See what she has to do. Sabal says I shouldn't be doing this. I am teaching you to protect yourself. Ah, the tourist. I'm Amita. This is Badra. Hi. Keep walking. Look, I overreacted back there. We're at war. We keep losing soldiers, the work keeps piling up. Is there anything I can do? I'm not a soldier, but I want to help. Okay. Sure. There's a farm not far from here. Penan runs it, but she's old and she could use your help with some wild animals. I need you to keep the hides intact, so use this. Badra. What are you... Pick it up. We have to use a bow and arrow to, I guess, keep the hides. But uh, if I remember correctly, this game works the same way, uh, the same way Far Cry 3 did. So we're just going to get extra hide for using a bow. That's not going to, they're not going to be any better per se. Uh, let's go to the shop real quick because we should have some weapons and things like that from, uh, from the Uplay stuff. And just in general, we should have a few weapons unlocked. Jesus. <laughs> We have 30, how do we already have this much? How do we, what? We already have $32,000 worth of stuff to sell. So we're at 82K. We're gonna keep all animal hides. So that's what the cool thing. If I quick sell, it only gets rid of, um, what's it called? It only gets rid of all the junk. We keep all our hides and that's what we're gonna do. I'm not gonna get rid of any hides uh for a while at least so we have the agm because of you play i think that's the only weapon we have from you play though everything else is just this is what you get at the beginning of the game as is um okay signature we have the sixer unlocked which again the best 
the best uh, weapons in the game are going to be signatures. And the best ones in the game is the warrior, the shredder, the bull, the bushman, and I believe the predator. Those are the best weapons in the game. Um, and the bushman's the best one purely because of what it is. <laughs> We only have to do two royal treks for that one, and then I can buy it for 320k. So we'll probably do that. I'll probably do two royal treks off camera so we can get this gun. Because this gun will be super useful. Because it's a silenced AK. Um, we can buy maps, which I'm not going to buy any of these until the end of the game when I actually need to go around the map doing everything. Um... There's not anything in here we need. We need to complete more missions for that. And then those are all upgrades. Refill ammo. Considering the war. Oh yeah, everything in this game is like way more expensive than it would be in a... Uh, and what's it called? Than it would be in Far Cry 3. Just that the price overall is increased for everything. I don't know why either, but that's just the way it is. And we gotta go that way. Auto, auto drive is a feature that that's how you use it it's a feature i'm pretty sure we had the same thing in far cry 3 but it just wasn't useful it's still not useful here really because auto drive goes so slow and if you hit the gas they, it just loses control entirely and you just crash so it's better if you just still control the vehicle yourself rather than using auto drive I mean, unless you're going really far and you want to go do something else or something. Also, we are going to play Far Cry Primal, Primal again. I think. Or I'm just going to finish Fuck. it off camera. I don't know. Far Cry Primal is kind of annoying. Uh, we'll pro we probably... sent me over. She said you might have some kind of wild animal problem. Hey, Amita, I have no idea what I'm supposed to do. <sighs> Wolves are a common nuisance for Kanan Farm. She's killed off a number of them, but this year they're especially aggressive, and I'm worried about it. There's a den nearby. Clear it out, huh? I think Kanan has supplies stockpiled somewhere on her farm that you can use. And yeah, I found them. Skin your kills. We can always use the pelts. I'm gonna use the pelts, bitch. You're funny. Yeah, these are exactly what we need, too. We need the wolf. Damn it. Double skin, clean kill. Boom. Yeah, we'll have more than enough if we get to, if we keep just getting clean kills. here and I guess fuck these guys up also wait is there do we have to make a wallet yeah and carry up to five. oh we can already carry up to 250 though it's not that bad definitely still gotta well we have to do holsters too and like if we're gonna do them right now when we kill these other two as long as we get clean kills because we have to have enough to send back to that lady uh well I don't, well, I don't remember her name there's a uh, chest up here. We 
serious? What is there for me to skin? Okay, well, I'm gonna craft that real quick. They're done. Cool. Let's go back up there. Is he chasing a tapir? I did not know. Let's just turn around. Let's head to it. Why did you turn that shark, brother? <sighs> Jesus. It's all good. Wedding photos. Killed them all. Hey. Badra, how are you? Good. I uh, brought you these pelts. I thought maybe you could use them. Hmm. It's a good Ajay. But you keep them. She has enough for her Tanka paintings. I'm sorry, Tanka what? This one is about the life of a guru. This one is about the demon Yalung. This one is about the goddess Kira. And that one is about Bhadra, the next Tarun Matara. The Tarun Matara is a living goddess, if you believe Sabal. It's no life for a child, being treated as an object, thing. <sighs> Thanks for your help. Later, we'll show you how to put those to good use. I already, already put them to good use. But sure. Alright. The wolf's den. Let's head back to uh, town. Oh, we got a skill point actually. Which we can use to either gain an additional health slot, healing syringes, or restore four health. Wait, we can't use that one. Speed of the repair tools greatly increase your harvest leaves better. Oh, there's this one. Let's just do. Let's just get our health up. Oh my god, this thing handles like poo. It's probably because it has three tires. Alright, we're just gonna mess with the store a little bit. Uh, and then that'll be it. We're gonna do the next mission next episode. Um, oh, movie, fat people. Fat people. Alright, um, trade, quick sale. Oh, that's worth 8200 though. I don't think we need the tiger or the, the wolf skin anymore. So I'm gonna sell that. Buy and customize. So now that we did that upgrade uh, to our thing, we can now own a weapon. Um, the question is what? What do we want to own? Hmm. I mean, we can't buy much. It's basically, do I want this? 
the A200, the STG90, or the AK47. Um, the, these both are SMGs and these both are ARs. I mean, this is, this is significantly better than the AK. And I mean, this is better than the A200. The fire rate's a little lower, but the damage in the range is higher. Um, I, I say we go with an AR. You can't really go wrong with an AR. Um, oh, that's sidearm. Oh. Okay. That's fine. Red dot. Extended mag. I'm painting it. Do primal, and then we'll do red dot. Oh, and then for sidearms, we could either do the Mark IV or we can go. These are actually like cool sidearms, or we can go straight to the AGM, which is what we're gonna do. You can actually suppress it, which is really cool, for forty-two thousand. Ooh, purple looks badass. Modern's ugly. Gold's cool. Thank you, young man. Oh, hold on. And my Ammo's full. Cool. All right, let's take a look at our guns real quick, and I'm on the video. My husband loves the Just gonna show them off real quick. Okay. So this, we're still not far enough. This is our, this is going to be our AR for a while, probably. For at least another two episodes, I would say, is we're going to be using that. This will probably be our sidearm of the entire game. This is the uh, pistol from Blood Dragon, which is an incredible game. But this will probably be our sidearm for the entirety of the game, cause, or at least up until the end, because this is already a really good sidearm to have. This we probably won't be using too long, hopefully. I want to try and use more weapons. Because, I mean, Far Cry 3, we were sticking to, like, a set of a few weapons. So, in here, I want to try and get as many weapons as possible. And mess with as many as possible as we play through the game. But next episode, we'll start Sabal's mission. And see where that takes us. Uh, this is all basically new to me. I mean, a little bit of it I remember because I played maybe three quarters of the way through the game, but I never finished it. And I haven't actually played through the campaign since 2015, 2014. So it's been a while. But yeah, we'll uh, see what we can get into next episode. That said, guys, I hope you guys enjoyed this video. If you guys did, please don't forget to like it, subscribe, comment down below what you guys want to see on the channel in the future. And uh, I hope you guys stay safe out there. And I'll catch you guys very soon in the next one. Peace out.